Hello and welcome. In today's episode, we are going to be doing lab 46. That is managing NTFS permission. So if you want to follow along on your Windows machine, you can uh, follow the instructions, but they are pretty straightforward. We have done them uh, these as well in the past. Let me go ahead. Part of in 16 that is basically server 2016 so we're gonna do the explorer this PC and open local this C project and then right click on it so from the project that is this one so it can be any folder on your machine I do believe that you have the same set on Windows 10 as well um, but uh, on server you get just itty bitty more uh, like options for example if memory serves me correct uh, on windows 10 we were able to share a folder with 20 like if 20 people are actively and by actively means they have the window open 21st person would not be able to access that folder even if somebody has opened the folder they are not doing anything they walk out of their uh, desk and just like this window is open and it's pointed to see so anybody the 21st person will not be able to if all 20 have connection but in Windows a uh, server you could share there could be a uh, 16,000 plus active uh, connections uh, so properties security tab and maybe oh maybe I, i'm able to show you that here um there's the boss list there was actually a specific mm, create one is selected in a group or username so there was like a specific setting where i could you could see the number nay like how many active connection could be but that might be in sharing and advanced sharing must be disabled share this folder and yeah, there there it is the mo the thing that i'm saying so they could be 16777 simultaneous users and but in windows you can have only 20. all right so it wants us to go to security tab then create uh, creator owner and we're going to click edit we're editing the creator owner properties and it says permission for project and these are the properties like which one you want users UCL and allow full control that would be this one now you have given it and everything else checks out automatically and basically what we have done is that creator owner anybody who is under users in uh, in the UC live lab forest OU, OU users so anybody who is inside that OU has the full permission that's it pretty simple so that's how you give permission so now anybody who is added to that group uh, will have full access all right so let's wrap this video here oh, i hope it has helped you if it has please read comment subscribe and share and i see you in the next one